Good morning, Vanana. Now I would like to discuss about the nature of the quadratic form. Okay. I am taking one problem. Find the nature of the quadratic form. 2x square plus 2y square plus 2z square plus 2yz. First we can write the quadratic form equation. Then that is q is equal to quadratic form is generally x transpose a into x. A is the coefficient matrix of the x column matrix. Here x column means x is involved in the three variables x, y, z. Actually x is a column matrix then that is x, y, z. In this a matrix means here the diagonal elements x, y, z, x, y, z. Here x into x, x square this is 2 y into y, y square, it is 2, z into z, z square, this is 2. Next, y, z means y, z in this position and z, y position. In this, we can take the y, z places are 2 places, so 2 y, z can be distributed into half 2 in y, z place and z, y place. Then 2 by 2 is equal to 1. 1 we can write here, the 1 is right here, okay. The remaining all positions are 0, why? Because the x, y and x, z terms are absent in the quadratic form, okay. First, we write the quadratic formation of the matrix that is q equal to x transpose ax. Here, where a is a symmetric matrix that is 2, 0, 0, 0, 2, 1, 0, 1, 2 is a symmetric matrix. It is a symmetric matrix means A transpose equal to A, then that is called as a symmetric matrix. Now we can find the nature of the quadratic minds to find the nature of the quadratic form. To find the nature of the quadratic form means first we can find out the eigenvalues of the coefficient matrix A by using of the characteristic equation. Okay. The characteristic equation is the characteristic equation is determinant of A minus lambda I is equal to 0. Okay. Now we can take the determinant 2 minus lambda 0, 0, 0, 2 minus lambda 1, 0, 1, 2 minus lambda is equal to 0. Why? Because the identity matrix is multiplied with the lambda. In identity only the diagonal elements are unit elements. So in the diagonal elements we subtract lambda from the diagonal elements. We are getting the characteristic equation is determinant of a minus lambda i equal to 0. Now we can find out the determinant 2 minus lambda into elimination of the first row and the first column. Then the minor matrix is 2 minus lambda into 2 minus lambda minus 1 1 is a 1 equal to 0. Why? Because the remaining other two elements are 0. Here 2 minus lambda into multiply 2 2 is a 4 minus 2 lambda minus 2 lambda plus lambda square minus 1 equal to 0. Okay? Here 2 minus lambda into lambda square minus 2 lambda minus 2 lambda 4 lambda 4 minus 3 is plus 3 equal to 0. Find out the factors. 2 minus lambda equal to 0. And lambda square minus 4 lambda plus 3 equal to 0. The factors are 3 1 are 3. 3 minus 3 minus 1 is minus 4. So minus 4 lambda can be written as minus 3 lambda minus lambda plus 3 equal to 0. Okay. Here. Taking lambda from the first two terms, taking minus 1 common in the last two terms, then it is lambda minus 3 is lambda minus 3 equal to 0. Lambda 
minus 3 is taking common, the remaining terms are lambda minus 1 equal to 0. So, lambda equal to 1 and 3. Therefore, lambda values are 1, 2, 3 or the lambda values from this lambda equal to 2. Here, all lambda values are positive. Okay. Here, Here, lambda values all are positive. So, the nature of quadratic form is positive definite. All are positive, then we can say that the nature is positive definite. The nature is positive definite means the eigenvalues all are positive then we can say that positive definite. If any one of the value is 0 remaining all are positive that is positive semi definite. If the lambda values all are negative we can say that the quadratic form is negative definite. If any one of the value is 0 and other are negatives we can say that negative semi definite if all are mixed with zero positive negative then we can say that that is indefinite okay this is a procedure of the how we can find the nature of the quadratic form first we can write the quadratic form matrix form that is x transpose ax in that we can take a matrix to find the characteristic vector characteristic roots of the given A matrix, coefficient matrix and find if the roots, we can say that the nature on the roots only. If the roots are positive, that is simply we can say that the nature of the quadratic form is positive, definite. This is the, okay. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel and share it to your friends.